There once was a planet. On the planet lived shape people. The shape people were simple. In order to survive, they needed four basic things. Fresh air, clean water, healthy food, and a safe home. They all worked hard to make enough money so they could have the things they needed. They also paid taxes, which meant that when they earned their money, they would give some of it to the king. The king was supposed to use the money to pay for things like schools and hospitals for the shape people, but he was greedy. He had a network of friends who would keep him in power as long as he continued to make them richer. Mr. Newsworth controlled the planet's media. The news would spread lies about the king, telling the shape people that he was the best king ever. Mr. Coleman controlled the planet's coal. The coal was burnt to make electricity, which was poisoning the planet. Mr. Coleman would pay Mr. Newsworth to convince the shape people to stay away from using solar and wind energy. Mr. Oilson controlled all the planet's oil. The king would help him to keep the price of oil high. Oil prices were always at their highest when a planet was at war. Mr. Warrington controlled the planet's weapons. When planets were at war, he would sell them weapons. The king would try to keep wars going for as long as possible. When the shape people were younger, they would play together happily without everyone noticing each other's differences. As they grew older, they began to notice that not all of them looked the same. Sometimes they could be unkind to those who stood out as different. Sometimes making other people feel bad gave them a feeling of togetherness. Joining in felt like being part of a group and was an easy way to feel safe. Eventually, they stopped forming close relationships and instead focused on their little yellow phones where they could ignore the world's problems. Through the news and through social media, the king could control what they saw, what they heard, and eventually what they thought. But it was hard to hide the effects of climate change. Mr. Coleman's coal burning was making the air thick with smog. The smog acted like a blanket, and so, when the sun shone down, the heat would get trapped underneath. This made the planet hotter. To protect Mr. Coleman's business, the king denied what was happening. To distract them, he gave them something else to be scared of. He was a charismatic leader. His followers hung on to his every word. He convinced the shape people that there is no such thing as climate change. To go against the king means to go against our planet. Triangles are dishonest, filthy, and dangerous. The king's denial of climate change made the shape people feel much better. They loved the king and how safe he made them feel. The news reported that the king had fixed the planet's problems. He told them that he was the greatest king there had ever been, and they believed him. The hatred towards the triangle people grew. They were constantly being reminded of the fact that they were no longer seen as shape people. If they did the slightest thing wrong, there were huge consequences. They would be locked in cages, away from their families and away from their children. They did not know if they would ever be let out. The other shapes felt the same as they did when they laughed at someone for looking different. It made them feel safe and a part of something. Mr. Oilson's oil pipes were also causing problems. The oil would often leak into rivers, which would poison the drinking water. The planet's heat only grew worse, causing enormous fires. The fires destroyed people's homes and killed millions of animals. Not every shape had supported the king or believed his lies. They were often bullied by the king and laughed at by his supporters. The shape people were divided into two sides, those who wanted to protect the king and those who wanted to protect the planet. The king was starting to lose supporters. Many shapes had decided who they wanted to be the next king. They called him and his new ideas Plan B. Plan B promised to stand up against the rich bullies who were destroying the planet. 
He would use the tax money to pay for more schools and hospitals. He also promised the triangles that they would be treated just as fairly as the squares and circles. The king's friends were furious and demanded he take control of his people. If he couldn't do this, they would find a new king who could. The king needed to look strong and distract people from the truth. He had to help his friends make more money so he could continue to be king. The king had always spread lies and fear in order to control his people. He told people that there was a dangerous leader on another planet that was planning a war and he needed to be stopped immediately. And so a war began.